right, the keto diet. This is quite a big one at the minute. Uh, basically what it is, you just don't eat any carbs. The idea of keto is you do not eat any carbs. You just eat protein and fat. Because all you eat is fat, all you can burn is fat. And your body basically turns itself into a machine that just burns fat. So that when you start eating other stuff, you still burn fat first, okay? Normally, you would burn carbs first. So the idea is you don't eat any carbs, you don't eat any sugar, all you can burn is fat, okay? Does it work? You can lose a lot of weight fairly quickly, yes. Uh, you can train within reason fairly intensely a little bit on it. But in general, in my personal view, anything that cuts anything out, especially something that extreme, will not be sustainable and you won't enjoy it and it'll be really difficult to stick to. Other negatives, can give you horrendously bad breath, you cut your carbs out, um, you can't be tired, you can't get headaches. And a lot of the weight loss you will achieve, especially in the first week, is normally water, okay? The thing that holds water in your body and in your muscles is your carbs. If you do not eat carbs, water then becomes very difficult to store, so you flush a load of that out. Um, so you lose a lot of weight, but it's not fat, it's water, most of the time, okay? So, it's the kind of thing you could, again, you can maybe do a week, two weeks before a holiday, just to give yourself that little push, um, and you could probably maintain it for a week or two. You could not maintain it for six months, okay? So it's not really a long-term plan. It's pretty good if you just need that little boost before a wedding or before a holiday or something like that, but do not rely on it. Um, I wouldn't really recommend it, to be honest. I have done it, and I did lose like six pounds in uh, 10 days, but felt absolutely horrendous. So do not, do not do it, I would recommend, unless you're literally, unless you go into it with the understanding that you're only gonna do it for five days, you'll probably look better, but you'll probably feel horrendous. Um, the best for eating plans, again, is just small calorie deficit, eat with a reason what you want, um, just track things, use my fitness pass, what we really recommend, just track the foods, Average female burns around 1,400 calories a day, so if you stick to that and you're fairly active consistently, you will be able to have wine, have chocolate, and not make many changes and still lose weight, and you could stick to that forever. Whereas cutting out carbs, never eating a biscuit or a sandwich for the rest of your life is not sustainable, okay? Uh, again, jump in the group if you need to. Any questions, just let me know.